Hello viewers, welcome to Engineering Study Materials. Today we are going to discuss about the theory of resolution of the invention related tasks commonly called as TRIS. It is a basic principle through which we can find a problem in the uh, departments or an industry. So this all can also be called as a theory of inventive problem solving. It is basically a problem solving technique. It was derived from the study of global patent literature developed by Atscheller. So it able to give the findings or results or of the problems and gives a way to uh, make a problem into a solution. The patterns in the nature of inventive solutions and the characteristics of the problems that these inventions have overcome. And Atscheller realized that a problem requires an inventive solution if improving one parameter impacts another negatively. In a metal cutting for example, if we increase the feed rate the tool wear is more. So if we increase the one parameter the another parameter is defected or gets uh, decreased. The research has produced three findings it was the major findings that is the problems and solutions are repeated across industries and countries sciences. Then the technical evolution also repeated because the minds of the people also change so that the human evolution takes place so that the technical evolution also happens. The innovations used scientific effects outside the field in which they are developed. So these are all the 40 principles that is segmentation, taking out, local quality, asymmetry, merging, universality, Russian dolls, anti-weight, preliminary anti-action, preliminary action, beforehand cushioning, equipotentiality, the other way round, spiritality, dynamics, partial or excessive actions, another dimension, mechanical vibration, periodic action, continuity of useful action, skipping, blessing in disguise, feedback, intermediary, self-service, copying, cheap short-lived objects, mechanic substitution, pneumatics and hydraulics, flexible shells and thin films, porous materials, color changes, homogeneity, discarding and recovering, parameter changes, phase transitions, thermal expansion, strong oxidants, inert atmosphere and finally composite materials. So let's discuss the description or some first segmentation. If a product is in wholesome, divide your product into independent parts and make a product sectional so that we can change a section not the complete product so increase the degree of objects fragmentation then extraction extraction is the if a part if a complete part we can find uh, find that is a defective we should notice which section or a part is disturbing the whole product then take out the disturbing part or property from an object then extract only the necessary part that is properly working in good condition then local quality no companies in the world produce only the standard products there may be companies producing some non-standard or local quality products because the standard products are not available in that style in that type they need so instead of uniform structure of your project use some non-uniform uniform structure of the object instead of uniform structure of an environment use non-uniform structure if two functions are to be performed by the same object it's cause problems divide the object into two parts and redesign then asymmetry if your object is symmetric shape make it asymmetry if it already asymmetrical increase the degree of asymmetry then consolidation consolidation in space homogeneous objects and consolidate in time homogeneous operations 
then universality if two projects or objects are differ make it as a single object then nesting nesting means one inside another that is a box inside a box place one object inside another so that the space required for the two object is minimized then increase the number of nested objects make one object dynamically pass through a cavity like a telescope telescopic cylinder of another objects when necessary then counterweight compensate for the weight of your object with merging it with another object and place your object into environment that provides aerodynamic hydrodynamic or other lifting force and prior contraction if your object is subjected to a harmful factors of environment subjected to antibodal action before hand that is before the danger would come keep preventive measures to that product prior action if your object is subjected to harmful factors create conditions that will prevent the harmful factors and if the object has to be changed and it is hard to achieve perform a required change of the object if a bird um, or uh, some some kind of thing the product will not cope up with the uh, strong hitting of the uh, if a product does not uh, withstand to the high amount of impact provide a covering for the object so that it will with, withstand that much of impact to that happening then early cushioning if your product is soft or unreliable create conditions in advance that will prevent the object and eq potentiality if your object is, has to be lowered or raised redesign the object's environment if you are placing a project in a land that is in a deep uh, deep land make provide the environment should be up so that the project uh, product can be in a flat position that is in top from the earth surface do it in reverse instead of actions defined performs opposite action make the mobile part of your fixer mobile part into fixed and fixed part into mobile then spiritality instead of linear parts of your object use curved parts use of rollers balls spirals this will, this will be useful and to reduce friction dynamicity if your object is immobile make it movable then divide your objects into parts that we discussed before and capable of moving relatively each other increase the degree of free motion and make your object into dy environmentally dynamically change in accord to the required conditions partial or excessive action if it is not possible to precisely achieve the required change or to perform some action reformulate the problem then another dimension if the object moves along a line consider into a 2d space if a object moves in 2d space consider it into a 3d space then rearrange the parts and tilt the objects or use the other side of given area mechanical vibrations make your object or its part to vibrate if it is not vibrating use resonance frequencies use piezoelectric vibrators instead of mechanical ones periodic action instead of continuous action use pulse actions vary the periodicity that is the time interval between the pulses according to the conditions use passes between impulses to perform some other action that is an intermittent pulse useful action continuity all parts of the objects must work continuously eliminate all the non moving or ideal running that is if a motor is running without linking with the gear is waste of money skip if your object is subject to do harmful or hazardous actions skip that turn the ham 
to one's good. Use harmful factors to achieve positive effects. Eliminate a harmful factor by adding it another with another harmful factor. Amplify the harmful factor to such degree so that it would stop bringing harm to the environment. Feedback. Introduce the feedback system. If the feedback is available, vary it in accord with operating conditions. Because feedback is the important principle. Uh, it will give the results of the previous process so that we can optimize the current process. Intermediary. Use an intermediate carrier to provide necessary actions. If it is not possible to use existing objects or parts, temporarily merge your product with another one. Self-service. The object must be self-service itself so that the repairing uh, service works can be minimized and use available resources use of copies if you need to undertake some actions with respect to unavailable flag fragile complicated or dangerous use it simpler cheaper copy use infrared or ultraviolet copies cheap short life instead of costly long life replace an expensive object with many cheap objects because if you want a drill bit that costs uh, 2000 make uh, or buy tool bits that cost only 100 bucks so that would be useful mechanical principle replacement replace mechanical principle behind our system and try with automatic uh, optical acoustic or magnetic some other principles pneumatic and hydraulic structures instead of solid object use gases or liquids flexible shells and thin films instead of heavy three-dimensional structures use the flexible shells use flexible shells to isolate the object from the environment porous materials make your object porous use porous coating because it will be reducing the weight of the whole product changing color to be attractive change the color of the a product homogeneity make interacting objects of the same material with identical properties reject or regeneration of the parts if a part of an object that has delivered to its function has become unnecessary or undesired eliminate it change of physical and chemical parameters change the aggregate state concentration or composition of the project change the degree of flexibility of the object change the temperature of the environment phase transition use of phenomena accompanied by phase transitions change of volume emission or absorption of heat thermal expansion use of thermal expansion or contraction of the materials and merge it to the materials with the different coefficients of thermal expansion so that would be helpful in the uh, temperature environments strong oxidizers replace the regular air with enriched air and replace the enriched air with pure oxygen ionize the air or oxygen use of ionized oxygen and use ozone inert atmosphere use inert gases of usual ones add neutral parts or additives to the object so that it will withstand in an every corrosive or salty environment composite materials replace materials homogeneous materials with composites only because the homogeneous materials such as metals etc are alloys are too heavy but the composites are less in weight and holds the same property that is strength toughness impact large impact producing withstanding properties are similar to the metals or alloys so that it will be helpful to the product to survive in an environment so this is a short video friends if you like this video put a thumbs up and share this video to your friends to gain knowledge and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more videos so thank you for watching